here at Walmart to pick up something I ordered online. Okay, got it. I'm excited. Let's open it up. I'll show you what it is. Put it up here. Man, I don't have my knife, huh? Yeah, the padding. Yeah, I'm gonna have fun popping these later. There it is. Isn't that beautiful? It's beautiful. Even the, just the box. The box is beautiful. The beautiful green shade interceptor tactical foot. Because that's what it is. Tactical boot. Oh yeah. Look at that. Huh? Huh? Isn't that cool? Look at that. Leather uppers. Nice grippy sole. Size ten and a half. That's my size. I got it at Walmart.com for $34.99. That the Interceptor guard. Beautiful. Beautiful. Even smells. <sighs> Even smells good. It smells like a brand new car. I love it. I love it. $34.99 at Walmart. This is how you can tell when it's almost summer. When they start to sell bathing suits and bikinis at Walmart. See that? See that beautiful floral print bikini? Bikini top? Look at that. Look at that mustard colored bikini. Isn't that nice? Doesn't that look nice on a girl? Not me though. Mommy. See just the whole row of bikinis and bathing suits. Walmart, we're going to the Target, right next door. Well, almost right next door. I'm at Target, and here's the Target model. I like that they don't airbrush the stretch, stretch marks down here. More natural, right? Okay, here are these shoes. These Interceptor Guard tactical shoes. Tactical boost that I bought at Walmart for $34.99. Aren't they cool? Aren't they cool? Look at that. Love, love these shoes, man. Look at that. Look at the shoes. Look at the, the sole. Really grippy sole. And oh, I forgot to tell you about the side zip. See that? See that side zip? For easy removal, like at the airport or on a plane. Yeah. Side zip here. Look at that. Isn't that cool? I love it. Love your shoes, man. Look at that. Look at that. Look at those shoes. back to the Filipino store. I'm just here by my usual spaghetti sauce. Filipino style spaghetti. Used to be around here. Oh here. It's still here. Yep. Wow, it's a different brand. Now look. No, no, it's the same brand. Different packaging. See? Sweet Filipino style. That's what I want. I guess I'll get the big I'll get the big one, huh? And uh, what else do we need? Mm, that's about it. Mm. Want some ding dongs? Ding dong! Not ding dong of a Zato or ding dong Dante, this is ding dong. Uh, what else we got here? Okay. 
What else do we need here? We need to... Uh, hmm. Some sardines, some Lego. With some Tupi. How about some Boy Baumann Cornick? What that? That's cool. Oh, growers. I used to eat a ton of these when I was a kid. Look at that. Growers. Oh, this is honey roasted. I used to eat just regular growers. Uh, here's a big Boy Baumann Cornick. Hmm. Well, here's the uh, growers. Uh, some uh, pasta, some uh, for pancit canton. You want that? Here's some flavoring, sinigang. You want some sinigang? Well, these Korean movies. There's some Korean movies here. And some more Korean movies. You know what I've never seen before? I've never seen cross-shaped Hershey bars for Easter until now. There you go. Now I've seen it all. Cross-shaped Hershey bars for Easter. Look at this beautiful Washington DC figurine. Made in China! Okay, we're done. Just a quick trip to Juliana's to buy some spaghetti sauce and then I'm off. Here's the restaurant next door. If you want to have a quick meal, Filipino food, that's where you can go. The Juliana's restaurant next door. But me, I'm gonna cook food myself. Two days later. <laughs>
right, that was St. Matthew's Cathedral down here on uh, Rhode Island Avenue. It's a Catholic church, but everyone is welcome, of course. Even me. Crisp and fresh, $100 bills. Mmm, smells like cash money. Day here in the city. Yeah, so like, okay. Alright, take a little walk. It's a nice day and all. Got me my usual Dunkin' Donuts. 